six-seater homers twice as Dodgers rally past Giants 6-4. Los Angeles AP Corey Seager hit two home runs, including a go-ahead, to run shot in the seventh inning, and the Los Angeles Dodgers rallied to defeat the San Francisco Giants 6-4 on Friday night. Seager capped a four-run seventh with a towering drive over the right field wall on a 0-1 pitch from reliever Josh Sosek 3-2 to lift the Dodgers to their sixth straight victory and their 37th win in their last 43 games. Seager's first homer gave the Dodgers a 1-0 lead in the first. He hit the first pitch from Giants starter Matt Moore deep into the left center field bleachers. This was Seager's second multi-homer game of the season, and his sixth in less than two major league seasons. He hit two home runs against the New York Mets on June 20 and has 18 on the season. Dodgers starter Alex Wood 12-1 got the win despite giving up four runs and eight hits over seven innings. He was coming off his worst start of the season, having given up a career-high nine runs, seven earned, in four and two-thirds innings against Atlanta last Saturday. Kenley Jansen pitched a scoreless ninth for his 26th save in 27 opportunities. Brandon Crawford hit his ninth home run in the second inning for the Giants, driving in 0-1 pitch from Wood a dozen rows into the right field bleachers. The Giants' bullpen was unable to hold a 4-2 lead as George Convis gave up Yasiel Puig's RBI ground out and Chris Taylor's run scoring single. The score was tied 4-4, setting the stage for Seager. The Giants took a 4-2 lead with three runs in the top of the seventh as Nick Hundley and Gorkis Hernandez stroked back-to-back run scoring doubles. J. Jiyun Wan had tied the game to 2-2 with an RBI single. Los Angeles had taken the 2-1 lead in the fifth by converting two walks, a wild pitch, an error and a ground ball into an unearned run. Austin Barnes walked, took second on a wild pitch, advancing to third on Hundley's wild throw to second. Jock Pedersen walked and broke for second when Wood pulled back after squaring to bunt and hit a hard grounder to shortstop, scoring Barnes from third. Moore held the Dodgers to two hits through his first six innings, only to surrender two runs in the seventh thanks to a walk and a double. Trade nerd room. Giants. 1B Brandon Belt was in the Giants' original starting lineup but was scratched about 90 minutes before the first pitch. Dodgers. 1B Adrian Gonzalez and of Andre Ethier both took early batting practice before Friday night's game. Gonzalez will hit in a simulated game on Sunday, and is expected to begin the rehab assignment next week. Up next, Giants, LHP tie block 7 to 6, 4.50 era comes off the losing effort in which he gave up five runs and eight hits over seven innings against San Diego. In his only appearance at Dodger Stadium, Block threw three perfect innings in relief on September 21, 2016. Dodgers, LHP Rich Hill 7 to 4, 3.48 era has limited opponents to four runs in 25 and one-third innings and posted the 3-0 mark over his last four starts, striking out 37, walking three. He's 3-1 three with a 2.37 era in his last five starts at Dodger Stadium. Hill is 3-2 with a 2.62 era in nine lifetime starts against the Giants.